So today is um, August 29th, 2011, and this is the first day for Mrs. Lorna Hopper. So can you tell me how long you've had fibro for? Um, you know, I'm not sure because I was having all these weird things going on. Um, I didn't know what it was. Uh, I had all these tests done. Can you guesstimate? Um, uh, More than 10 years? Well, you know, I worked hard. I've worked all my life since I was a child. Uh, I, nine, 10, you know, back then. Uh, I, I babysat, you know, I helped. Okay, so you're not really sure. Tell me about your pain. My pain started escalating. Um, I would miss work. Where lot. is the pain exactly? Just tell me. It, it depends from day to day. Uh -huh. um, tell me some of the different spots. Okay. Um, clothes. You know, I, I feel like my nerves are right up here the back of my head oh my gosh there's nothing in my hair head but back here it, it just feels like ah you know bad case of dandruff or whatever do you have pain in the neck and I have pain in my neck um, I have pain in my head uh, you know it just like itches do you have pain but in the there's arms nothing there yeah um, I uh, this arm was hurting for like three days. Um, I noticed if I, um, I have to think about that. <laughs> if if I if I uh, if if I have you know like a a hard day. It, it could be, I mean, I, when, when I'm talking hard day, like, um, stressful day, it, it'll hit me the next day, and then I have attacks. Right. And have they you, could last for two, three, four days. You have know? you had pain in the legs? Yeah. Pain in the back? Right in my shin. Uh-huh. In my shin. Um, what about the back? Oh, my gosh. Right now, it's right here on this side. Um, and you have, you said you have a headache now. Yeah. How often do you have the headaches? Oh, uh, every day. Every day I have a headache. Okay. And, uh, I didn't wear my glasses, and I should have, but I didn't. Um, I have two pair. I have a, a really dark pair, um, and then I have my trans trans. Mm -hmm. position yes um, so your eyes are very sensitive mm -hmm. and okay what about your thinking is it very difficult to think I have I, I have to think for a minute you know or you know I have to think and and then it comes to me is it hard and to, is I, it hard to put thoughts together sometimes Sometimes not, and then it's weird. I have nightmares sometimes. What and, about your um, memory? I go back. I go back, like in time, and it was like yesterday. Mm-hmm. Um, How's your memory? My memory, like I said, it, it's part of, um, you know, uh, a thinking. I have. I I have to think. I, I noticed I've been having a hard time swallowing. Do you have other problems with your stomach? Reflux, irritable bowels? You know, years ago I did, and uh -huh. then it went away. Uh, I saw a dietitianary, and, um, you know, I watch what I eat, and, uh, and it went away. I was on the patch for a while. I lost a lot of weight. I was down to, like, uh, I don't know, 98 pounds or so. Um, Are you able to sleep without medication? Uh, I am in so much pain. I get up in the middle of the night. I ha I get insomnia. Um, two nights in a row. I had it uh, the other day. You know. Um, 
comes and it goes. I toss and turn. I got a sleep number bed. We we got a sleep sleep number bed and uh, to help. And uh, you know I I get tired. You During know, the day. I, I, I do stuff and then I have to lay down. Okay. Or you know So you're very tired all the time. Tired. Yeah, and I take I take vitamins, I take uh, prenatal and then B you know B twelve. What are some of the medications you're taking? Uh all I take, you know, I, I, I don't like the side effects of uh, Lyrica, all that crap. What are you taking now? I'm taking. I take Vicodin. I take. Um, I take uh, Valium, Zoloft, and uh, uh, Fioracet for my migraines. Right. Any other symptoms we didn't mention? Yeah, it's weird because um, before I could say anything. Um, Soft spots in my head, you know, I didn't know what that was. I thought I bumped my head and, and, uh... So your skin is very sensitive. Well, very. And I, I might be able to wear this today. I have the so soft clothes, but tomorrow, <laughs> you know, I, it changes from, from day to day. I don't know what I'll be able to wear. Right. Comfort is everything. And then my feet hurt. Um, I used to stand, walk all over the place, you know, no problem. And uh, now it's like, oh. What do your feet feel like when you walk? I'm tired and they hurt and I have to massage them a little bit. Do they feel like you're walking on pebbles or glass or? They just hurt. Just hurt. Yeah. Anything and, you'd and like to add? my shins, hit? you know, my, right here I noticed um, the past week it's been hurting. Okay. Um, my hands hurt. Uh, I get, I get like hives sometimes right here and then especially in the back of my neck right here. I feel like there's like um, something crawling on me. Right. And, and there's nothing there. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. Uh, okay. Anything else you can think of? Uh, my toes hurt. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I have to have comfortable shoes. I, I, uh, I have to have comfortable socks. Uh, Do you find it difficult talking sometimes? Yes. The words just don't quite come out? Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, my daughter got married recently <clears throat> and uh, I was stumbling and you know my my family was like were, were you drinking? And I'm like no it's it's part of the fibro. Um, you know the stress of everything. I, I like you know, bob back and forth, and and I mean, I almost fell, and I grabbed the hold of the, the table. Right. Um. You know things like that, and. Uh, pretty depressing, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Feel pretty depressed. Very, very. Mm. De well, I cry a lot. I, I cry a lot. Okay. Anything you'd like to add before I turn this off? Um, it's hell. <laughs> it's hell. From being very active, um, outgoing, you know, to to being a hermit because I don't want people seeing me, you know, and I'll just cry out of nowhere, you know. And um, if I have a hard time or a hard day, as far as um, stress, the next day, or if I overdo it, you know, um, 
like sweeping or whatever or you know we've changed roles uh, and I used to do it all I used to work you know everything and I can't I I feel helpless. How old are you, by the way? Um, I, I March I turned uh, um, I turned uh, forty four forty seven. Okay. This is Lorna. Hopper, and it's about, oh, I guess, nine weeks since she started. And just um, tell me your story so far. Tell me how you're doing, Lorna. Well, I'm I'm not bedridden, and uh, I'm able to go out um, three, four, five times a, a day. Um, I'm doing a lot better. Uh huh. How's your mind? Speak clearer, louder. Clearer. My mind is very, a lot clearer. Um, gets clearer every day. Um, I still I have good days and bad, but more good than bad. Um, I don't feel the fibro pain as bad, the burning, the extreme pain all over my body. Um, I feel great, actually. <laughs> uh huh. When um, um, you have um, when you say bad days, mm -hmm. that's not like when you had fibro. No, that's just it's compared to it. No, not the severe pain. Um, I'm not. I don't have the. I'm not frowning like I always was. Um, my eyes are clearer. Uh -huh. Do you find yourself able to concentrate better? I can focus better. Yeah, I, I can focus a lot better. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And so overall, you feel much much better. Yeah, I do. Extremely. Um, I'm saying ninety five percent better than what I, when I came here. Um, I haven't taken any pain meds um, for two weeks, and I don't feel the need to have to take the uh, Vicodin I was on. And how long were you on the Vicodin for? About 20 years. And so you've been off the Vicodin now for two weeks? Yes. Uh-huh. That itself is amazing. Yeah, and the Valium. Uh-huh, and the Valium for 20 years, mm -hmm. and so you're off your meds now? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to pass it over to Jay. Mm -hmm. And Jay, what, um, again a little loud, what changes do you see with Lorna? Well, I see a lot of changes in there. <laughs> Go ahead and tell me and speak a little loud. Well, she's laughing more. I can talk to her, hold on a conversation with her. She's happy now. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm silly. Yeah, <laughs> again. <laughs> I'm my old pretty pretty silly self. <laughs> 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 Embarrassing. <laughs> no, don't be embarrassed. I'm not a TV personality. Uh, and the last question I'll say is, um, what do you think of me in the office? And awesome. Have awesome. Um, thank God for my mother-in-law who, uh, who found you and um, and my husband for standing by me and um, me for fighting to be here. <laughs> um, it was a fight to get here. And I had to keep fighting myself and telling myself it's got, you know, there's hope, there's hope, there's hope. And uh, stay away from negative books. I bought a negative book and uh, I was really depressed after I read it. But um, Dr. Martin has given me the will to um, to go on and um, to, to know that, that there is hope. There is hope. I, I believed in it and it, it came true. And the people here are awesome. Joanne. Um, uh, Dr. Martin, you know, and my doctor at home was awesome. Catherine. Catherine, the the mas massage massage ther therapist was uh -huh. great. Um, yeah, she was awesome. So it was it was a positive experience. Very positive. But you yeah. said you're ninety five percent from better. being a hermit, <laughs> bedridden, not getting out at all. I was to the point of not getting out. My family, I didn't want to talk to anybody because I was in so much pain. Now I'm looking forward to spending time with my grandkids, you know. I, I don't have to tell them, Grandma can't do it today. Grandma's going to do it today, <laughs> you know. Uh -huh. I'm going to play with them. Um, I've got to take it easy still, but, you know, every day is a better day. Uh-huh. Would you say that um, you feel that there is a solution for fibromyalgia? I do. I do. I'm, I'm going through it right now. You're um, proof of it. I'm proof of it. Yeah, um, I'm back again. I'm, I'm. I lost my edge, and now I feel like I'm starting to get it back. You're back to Lorna. Yeah, getting there every day. I'm getting 
Yeah. I'm st I've so, still got... So you have a lot of catching up to do, right? Yes, I do. A lot of life to catch up after 20 years. Yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah. Good. I'm glad. Okay. Well, thanks. <laughs>